Hey guys, welcome to another Mr. Mutech video. Today we are going to talk about how to turn off an Xbox controller when it is connected to an iPhone. Now you may have noticed if you're doing something else on your iPhone and your Xbox controller is just connected in the background, might be taking up some battery or might just be interfering with the normal things that you might be doing in a different app. So to start, we wanna go ahead and work with the Xbox controller. Now, if you see the power button on, you're just going to want to hold it down and it seems like it takes a long time, but you just need to hold on to the power button, press it in and just hold it for a long time until you actually see that power button go off. And now you can see that it is off. So it is not connected any longer to my device here. So if you go in, you see on the Bluetooth settings, we're going to look and see if there's anything connected, nothing's connected. However, if this is a problem that you can't seem to turn off the Xbox controller and this button just won't seem to work, the next thing that we're gonna have to do is actually disconnect it directly from the iPhone device. So what you can do is you can just go into your iPhone device under settings. And once we go into the settings, we're just going to go to the Bluetooth and we're going to see if it's connected or if it's on. If this keeps just connecting, just go ahead and tap on this little eye here. And once you do that, we can just tap on forget this device. And then we're going to get a prompt at the very bottom. We're just gonna tap again, forget device. And then moving forward, this Xbox controller should no longer be connected. And it's just going to shut off automatically on its own once you do that disconnect on your iPhone. Hopefully this was helpful for you guys, and if so, feel free to give me a like. Thank you so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Take care.